Oh my god. Damn. Forgot he ended up like that. <laughs> And in other news, we have more on the recent string of unexplained deaths that seem to be exclusively involving young men. Cause of death is unknown, and while police are investigating accidental causes, foul play has apparently not been ruled Hey, out. change it! The Chief match is on! No! Oh, two beers over here! Coming! Catherine keeps telling me how her mother is constantly calling her. She says she's not worried about it, though. Feather's totally gonna take it, right, Vinny? And what do you think? So, who are you betting on? Come on, pick one. Are you kidding? Women's wrestling? What I know. <sighs> Sounds to me like she finally wants you to tie the knot. Uh, you think so too? What else could it be? I've known you since we were kids, but wow, you. Married, huh? Hey, nothing set in stone yet. What, you don't want to marry your girlfriend? It's not that. I, mean, I love her, but I don't think we need to run out and get married. You know, it's it's like we're comfortable where we are. Are you? Uh, that's what she said. Her job's always most important to her. You know she's always been the ambitious type, right? It doesn't mean she'll always be like that. That's not what I mean. Besides... You're single, too. Hey, I'm still looking for my soulmate. <laughs> I'm not like you. I've already told my girl that I'm not interested in marrying her. What if you never meet your soulmate? Then I'll never get married. So what? That sounds just like you, Chief. Anyway, did you hear about Paul? He's dead. Paul? Wait, that Paul? He's dead? Yeah. I heard he just got divorced, but he looked healthy. It's a complete shock. What happened to him? An accident? I don't know. Apparently his mother just found him dead in his room this morning. This morning? Wait, you mean... Yeah. The mystery death on the news? That was him. Holy shit! No way! Maybe Will will wind up dead tomorrow, too. Shut the hell up. Man, I hate the news. They're always trying to push their agenda for ratings. Toby, you are really easy to mess with. <laughs> well, speaking of crazy stuff this morning, I pissed the bed for the first time since grade school. What? Oh, that's messed up, man. <laughs> I had a really scary dream. But I don't remember what it was about. Oh, man. How old are you? 32. I know that. You know, I don't think I need to hear this. Me neither. Shut up. I was really fucking scared, all right? Oh, where are you guys going? Stick around. I, I don't want to go home just yet. So, why don't you have Catherine meet you here? No, I just saw her today. Besides, she'd get mad at me if I told her. Ah, jeez. What does she see in this poor fool? Sorry, but I gotta be in early tomorrow. Don't drink too much, okay? All right, take care, Vince. See you later. Oh, wow. <laughs> First time since grade school I pissed in my bed. Damn. That dream must have freaking terrified you. <laughs> my God. I got mail. From your phone, you can check your text messages and save. You could even reply to some messages. Be sure to read them when they come. All right. Seems easy enough. All right. What did I get? Checking in from Catherine. Like I said before, I'm having dinner with some old friends. It's surprising. Most of them are already married and almost have almost half of them have kids. They're all showing off pictures of their families and it makes me feel left out. Maybe it's time for us to get out of our comfort zone too. See, here's the thing with comfort zones. What if I turn out to be uncomfortable with that? What happens then? See what I mean? I guess that's what Vincent is going through and I can totally understand that. Let me see. 
You know what's the good thing about this? You get to keep... When you reply back, there's like three versions of replying back. For example, there's this one. Does it bother you? I worry about it sometimes. Maybe we should talk about this. Good night. Then... Nah. There's the second version, which is... You're overthinking it. I think we're okay as we are. We don't need to rush into things. Let's catch a movie sometime. See ya. And I think this is the cruelest one that you can say is, Sorry, I can't think right now. My brain's full of stuff. Insufficient brain power to continue conversation. Oh, shit. Nah, can't do it. Nah. <laughs> That's fucked up. I guess it's this one. Yeah. So you can say that the first reply message is the good message, while the last one is the bad message. I, I think that's the way how it goes. Yeah, I'll send this message. Also, it has a morality system. You could be good or you can be bad, depending on how much of a good or bad boyfriend you want to be in this game. So, as the good person that I always want to be in video games, I'm going to pick the good boyfriend. <laughs> Let's see, press when you press the confirm button, a new line will be added to reply. Press cancel to button to erase the last line and press the confirm button again to write a different phrase in, in its place. Choose the words you want to reply with. Be honest with your choices. Well, I would reply that way, so I would assume that I'm honest. When you spend time in the stray sleep, you will receive a text message on your phone. You can even reply to some of those messages. Depending on how you reply, Vincent's feelings reply Vincent's feelings and those of the person he is writing to may change. Oh, 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 I get it. This is a two-part message. Okay, I get it. And that's it. When certain words and actions change Vincent's inner ideas, a meter will be shown. Vincent's words and actions will affect the story. Remember it. Alright. I like games like that. That has a morality system. Hey. How many years have we been together? Marriage, huh? I figured this would happen eventually, but just changed jobs. I don't want to give her trouble. We got another got text message. Spam? Congratulations from Midnight Venus. You have successfully completed stage one of the Underground Cemetery. Go to the awards in the cell phone menu to check your best score on stage one. I can't be proud because I, I got gold on easy. I can't be proud of that. I wonder if I can get out of that seat. Getting up her parents out of the blue? It's not like her. Another one? You got mail. Wait a second, this is from Catherine again. Are you out drinking at Stray Sheep again? You know you have work tomorrow. Jeez, take it easy, okay? Alright, uh, I gotta reply. Guilty as charged. I'll make sure I don't drink enough to get a hangover. Take care of yourself. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me see the other choices. No. no, I'm not there. Don't get too crazy with your friends. Later! <laughs> What's the other one? You don't own me, but don't you stay out too late either, okay? Later! <laughs> I'm sorry, I just love saying later. No. Okay, as a good boyfriend, obviously, this is the best way to reply. Plus, I don't have to use... I don't have to shorten my words just so I can say later. No, L eight R. Sound weird to me. All right. All right. I think that's about it. Is he just gonna sit there and drink? I'm pretty sure you can get out. I still feel like going home today. Ah, it's late. You are about to go to the next scene without saving. Are you sure you want to continue without saving? No, I want to save. Yeah, just remember that. Save. Check and save data. This is my... This is my normal, everyday playthrough. This is my walkthrough playthrough saves. 
Yeah, it sounds weird when I say those two words together. Walk through Playboy. Yeah. Oh, cutscene. You're probably wondering where is the love. I think this is when the whole love consequence starts. I'm not sure. Is it this scene? I knew what they were talking about. Is this a, this is just me, but I find it weird that if you have a girlfriend, why are you allowing a girl to be like around you in a way? Ah, it's you. <laughs> what are you waiting for? Especially, especially if this is just a random girl. This is, this is not like a friend or anything. This is just a random girl that he does not know. I don't know. I just find it weird to me. Prison of despair. I think I'm dreaming again. I'm not sure. Yeah, this is a dream. Where am I? Last night's dream again? What the hell? I was at the bar and this girl came in and then... Damn, I can't remember. What is going on? Alright. Whoa! You the new guy from last night? I... pretty much. Boys, you're that guy from yesterday. Listen, watch out for the cracked blocks. They'll break after you step on them. Really? There are several types of blocks, such as cracked blocks and heavy blocks. Whenever you see a new block, proceed with caution. Proceed with caution. Oh, good. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Yeah. Good. Right, got it. Nice. You know you can Ooh. hang from blocks, right? It's a really useful technique. If there's nothing to stand on when you pull a block out, you'll hang from the edge. If you try to move to a space without a block, you'll hang as well. Try it out. From there, you can move around. It's a useful way to maneuver. Seems easy. <laughs> All right, I got it. All right, I got it. All right, I got it. Uh... Damn it. Oh, wait, no. Forgot. The hanging thing. All right, I got it. If you can't see ahead of you, try looking around. You might find an easy path up. Use the right stick to look around. Okay. If you're stuck, take a look at that before you. Oh, oh, nice. I'm almost there. Oh. Oh. I got this. You can also push rows of blocks all at once, too. Rows of blocks can be pushed together. There's no limit to how Edge. Edge. Oh shit. Edge. Edge. All right. All right, I got it. When you touch a checkpoint, you will start from there if you need to retry. If you come across one, be sure to tag it. All right, I got it. Edge. All right. All right, I got it. You've come pretty far. Good job. I'll see you at the landing. Everybody else is there, too. Who's everyone? I did not think this through. Yeah, I did not think this through. 
Oh, fuck. Oh, come on! You see, I'm not really good at puzzles. <laughs> There we go. Safety bonus.